I don't like the way that components get created in Figma. So I created a new plugin called Pop a Component that makes plugin creation much easier and much faster. So if I have something like this with a button, and I'd like this to be a component, I click the Create Component button, but I don't like to have the main component sitting here in the artboard. Almost every single time, I'm gonna want that outside the artboard so I don't get confused about what's the main component and what's an instance. So I drag this out, create an instance with option drag, and drag it back in. But I need to make sure it's in the same spot, so I'm like nudging it all around, trying to get it lined up where it was. I realize that it was in a group, so I'm trying to find where that group is, get it back into the group, and then I hope that I got it back into the same place. I don't like this process. I would like for there to be a single button that I press that creates a component outside of the artboard, leaves behind an instance where the original layers were, and then I'd be done in one step. That's why I created the Papa Component plugin, and that's exactly what it does. So let me undo what I just did, and I'm gonna install the Papa Component plugin. If you wanna install it, there's a link in the description. So this time, I'll get the button selected, go to my plugins menu, and choose Papa Component. Now instantly, I have a main component floating outside of the artboard. I can put it wherever I want it and that left behind an instance. So I find that way easier, way faster, and I don't have to worry about my original instance being placed back exactly where it was. Now where this becomes way faster is if you assign a custom keyboard shortcut to the plugin. There's another video on my channel where I explain how to create a custom keyboard shortcut for any of your Figma plugins. So I've done that here with Control Command K, and now I can just select anything. If I have any whim towards creating a component, hit the keyboard shortcut, there it is. Maybe this red one hit the keyboard shortcut, and you can see those are now main components with the instance left behind. So this is super fast. This is the way I create components almost every time now. It's really become an important part of my workflow. So go install it. There's a link in the description and watch my other video on how to set up custom keyboard shortcuts to make sure that you can access it really quickly.